No paparazzi, please. Can I just live? Can I just live? Can I just live? Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I haven't posted in a while, but I'm here because I have some time before my class starts or before I have to leave um, home to go to school. Wow, totally loving it. Today's Monday. Actually, I like I like Mondays because my classes are pretty good. Well, one class and then a workshop. Okay, whatever. Anyways, um, so you guys, I'm coming to you live from my bedroom to tell you that some interest to tell you some interesting news. Um, so today, um, this week is gonna be a busy week for me. I have. Like a presentation to do in one of my classes on Wednesday. I have to watch Fantastic Beasts movie on Thursday. Um, and then Friday, I'm going to a fitting um, um, at City Line. So, okay, can I get like fucking backtrack? I saw, well, somebody that I worked with tagged me in this post um, for somebody who works on the show City Line. So if you guys have never heard of it, it's like a morning show in Toronto. And every Friday they do Fashion Fridays. So they basically, like, a, like they're chit-chatting. It's like a talk show and then like a model comes out and then like shows the look. It goes like this. <laughs> um, so my co- my- a girl that I used to work with tagged me in this post where this stylist is looking for a model, for a plus size model. Um, in Toronto to be on the show and I so I submitted like an email to them like back back in the summer and then she responded saying oh yeah like you're gonna be on the roster blah 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 and then I haven't heard from her in like months I'm like okay there's no way I'm gonna um, be on TV anytime soon so what do you know she mess she emails me like a couple weeks ago saying that they're doing she's doing a holiday fashion segment um, November the 23rd, so basically I'm gonna be on TV, bitch. I'm gonna find her, no lie, you know this. So I'm gonna be on TV, bitch. <laughs> um, <laughs> and it's really exciting, so this Friday I have to go to a fitting. So basically, she said it's gonna only take 20 minutes, so I'm gonna have to like, I guess, try on the outfit that she picked. See if everything fits, and if it doesn't, then your girl needs to get back on the diet. <laughs> um, but anyways, yeah, I think everything will go well. Um, I've never, well actually, no, I've been on TV, but like not been featured on TV. You know, I was in like the background of things. Um, if you guys remember Much Music, um, they used to have like live shows where like celebrities would come and then you'd be in the audience and stuff. I did that for um, um, for Neville Longbottom from Harry Potter, um, and then did the Jonas Brothers and shit. But I was definitely not on on camera then. But so yeah, I'm like out of breath. So you guys, I'm really excited. Yo, girl, gonna be on TV. We made it, bitch. <laughs> Mama, we made it. <laughs> um, if you guys have ever been on TV, if you guys have any advice or tips for me that you would like to share write them down in the comments below like i know i'm gonna obviously have to like walk out in an outfit um be fierce um and it's not like like i already watched some of the some of the looks for that she does and she does a pretty good job with them and the models that walk out they look pretty like they don't look like you know like stuck up models like like they look like everyday people um, so they're like giggling and laughing and one of some something I'm nervous about is that I'm gonna start dying of laughter right when I they open the door and right when I come out. I don't know. <laughs> but um we shall see how it goes. I So I have a couple of girls from my classes that I told that I'm gonna be um, on TV doing this and one of them actually wanted to be in the audience but I don't think she can because, well I don't know, like I looked in, we looked into it and I thought I thought I saw you had to like reserve seats in advance so I don't know if that's gonna end up working but 
Um, yeah, people are excited for me. I'm excited too. I kind of feel like it'd be better if I don't know anyone in the audience because if I come out and I see someone that I know and I see their face, like I'll just be distracted or like I'll be extra nervous and like start laughing and everything. But yeah, so I'm gonna try to practice my catwalk. <laughs> if you guys know me, you know that I don't really wear heels often. So I'm a, it's a holiday look, so it's for sure going to be some type of dress, maybe a pantsuit or some shit, like a like New Year's outfit or even Christmas outfit. I don't know, something thinking something red, something velvet, something holiday and festive-ish. Um, but yeah, you guys, this is honestly this is crazy because I've never imagined myself being a model on TV walking out like that like it's just so weird and um her name is Tracy so I'm gonna link like her Instagram down below because if you guys want to keep track and see me on it if you guys aren't from the um aren't from Canada don't have the show I think it does air in some American cities but I'm gonna link all the information down below like her Instagram because I know she posts like l her models and like um clips of the show onto her instagram so i'll show you guys that and also they have a website so um but i'm definitely going to be making another video showing you a clip of me walking out and whatever <laughs> um and giving you guys like my experience my experience being um a supermodel on television <laughs> but yeah so <laughs> that's what's going to happen um, yeah, so if you guys have any advice you guys want to give me, let me know. Um, I, yes, I know to be confident and walk fierce, but like if you guys have any experience or know anyone that has done modeling before, um, let me know down in the comments below. Um, and yeah. Oh, and side notes. The Victoria's Secret fucking fashion show thing, um, that they said that, um, they don't want plus size or transgender people to be in their show because it's all about a fantasy. And they want like perfect bodies, perfect skinny bodies to be the fantasy or whatever. I just think that's ridiculous. Um, like, come on. That's just, that just confirms that that brand doesn't cater to anyone that's not, like, that's not above a size 12 or not, not even. Like, I don't think I've ever go bought clothes actually i did from victoria's secret pink but that was like way back in the day i've never fit into their bras or their underwear so whatever but if you guys shop there and if you guys care about social justice i would suggest not to shop there ever again <laughs> there's plenty of other good stores that you can shop at that provide you know good lingerie and stuff um anyways that's that's another issue so you guys, your girl's gonna be on TV. Um, I will definitely make a video updating you guys on my experience. So this Friday I have a fitting. And just to give you a, a heads up you guys, school is getting really busy this time of month. And November is when everything's due. So this week I have a presentation. Last week I had a book review to, to write. Next week I have a research paper proposal. And that's all for one class. I have three of them. Um, Things are getting hectic, but I'm getting things done. I already contacted, I'm supposed to have like a supervisor committee um, to help me with my research. I already solidified one person. I emailed the next person and she responded to me. She wants to, she's gonna meet with me. Um, she said after like the last week of November, so I still gotta wait for that. Um, but yeah, the year is almost done, you guys. It's almost December. And you guys i know i always fucking say oh i'm gonna be making more videos i'm gonna do this do this right now you guys i think as soon as i'm done this wave of work i have basically all of december off so i think that's when i'm gonna get back into the swing of things making more videos perhaps joining the gym because you guys i've gained Maybe 10, not even 10 pounds. Yeah, I probably gained or been around the same 260 to 2000, 2000 260 to 270 pounds. I've been around that range for so long now. 
and I kind of like the thing is you guys if I lose more weight all of my size 16 jeans will be too big for me and it's like can I just be the size like why <laughs> but I do feel like sometimes like I just want to like like work on my stomach a bit because I notice like my jeans kind of fit a little snugger than usual and I've been crazy hungry lately <laughs> Like, this weekend, what did we have for dinner? This weekend I had all-you-can-eat sushi. I love that. Um, and then we had, we had Subway, which wasn't that bad. And then we had like a nice big chunky burrito. And that was pretty good too, but you know. And then we have snacks in between. So it just all adds up. So I gotta stay in shape for my TV appearance. Hopefully, I mean, if I do well at this one, if I go in and be friendly and, and like, put on, put my best foot forward, um, hopefully they'll, I'll, they'll be reached, they'll, they will reach out to me again to have me back on the show as a model, as a recurring model. And you guys, you guys never know what opportunities can come from that. <laughs> Anyways, guys, so I've done, I've done been rambling. I'm going to go, um downstairs and put my boots on and get ready to leave thank you guys so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in my next one and stay tuned for Livy on live tv well it's not live but it's pre-recorded but still okay bye guys and follow me on instagram too if you want to see like updates and stuff because i'll keep you guys updated with what's going on with my life with everything in general you'll see everything on instagram okay guys i'll see you guys in my next one thanks for watching